To set up eSIM on the Samsung S25, first of all, you will have to navigate into settings. Now go into connections and move into SIM manager. Then go to add eSIM. And right now you should actually prepare your card. So that's how it actually looks in my case. So you will have this QR code, but sometimes uh, you, will, you can actually receive this QR code via email. So it actually depends of your provider. Now we have to just wait for the loading process. And right now we can transfer SIM from your another phone. You can for sure do this, but you can also scan the QR code like I mentioned, or you can even search for eSIMs. So if you choose this method, uh, let's open it. And here you can find another method, an activation code. So it's also available uh, on your uh, SIM card. You can input it here and then click down. If you want to scan QR code, you can for sure do this. But if you receive your QR code via email, then you can also uh, take a screenshot of it, then go to the gallery and pick this from your albums. And that's basically all you need to know. Then you can find some base information on the screen that you have to follow. If you find it useful, please leave a like and a comment below.